What's up guys, Ben here, and welcome to my unboxing of the EVGA Next 650G Power Supply. Now this is the power supply for my PC build, and obviously that G stands for gold. So this is a gold certified power supply, and it's saying basically that EVGA is like a number one uh, products reseller in the UK and the USA. 650 obviously stands for the 650 watt as well but this is going to be the unboxing of the power supply and if you guys aren't familiar already this is part of the pc build project where we upload a video every day until the 8th of march uh 6 p.m gmt so be there or be square hope to see you there next time so yeah this is getting late into the playlist series as well though so yeah it might be over soon but yeah we're cracking into this box and it's fully modular power supply, so this basically means your cables are going to be, like, they're going to be free. So you can just plug in the ones you need, and the ones you don't need, you can leave out. But the cables included is 1 times a 24-pin ATX cable. You've got a 2 times 4 plus 4-pin ESP 12-volt CPU cables. You've got 4 times 6 plus 2-pin PCIe VGA cables. You've got 3 times 3 SATA cables. 1 times a Molex cable and one times three a molex cable plus floppy connector <laughs> so yeah if you're using one of those bad boys still then it's going to be all right but this right here is the um motherboard connector uh you just got all the cables you need in there like nicely um braided i don't know if that's what you kind of call these cables but you know and here's the wall adapter for the uk as i am in the uk but obviously if you buy this from the us you will be fitted with that us connector and here's quite a lot of connectors here. They're all just bundled up, and I did read out all of the connectors that are in the box at the start. So, yeah, just great cables, really. They're kind of well, nice uh, braided and stuff. But I might actually pick up some uh, cable extensions just to clean up the look of the case. Some, like, red cable extensions. Um, as there is a tiny bit of, like, rubber, the, the um, like, braidedness of the cables, if you like, doesn't go all the way up to the plastic. But here's the manual to get you going, just some stuff about, obviously it says there the 750G series as well, so that's the same manual for both. But here's the power supply itself, and they are boasting about this ball bearing design, uh, ultra quiet 2 ball bearing design. Um, many of you are really quiet, and it's a nice design on the power supply as well. Obviously in the NZXT H440, which I'm rocking as my case, you don't actually see this power supply, but I wouldn't be ashamed to be showing this power supply off in certain, like a Corsair case, where usually they do show the power supply. But on the top there you can see the fan with the EVGA logo and on the back here we got our on and off as well as our power input. On the side we got some information and our wattage and stuff like all the information that you're going to kind of need just to glance at and it actually looks decent as well and overall like the whole thing's got this kind of matte texture and right here we have all our inputs for the cables. Now I will say the motherboard connector is very, very stiff to get in. So yeah, you want to just keep pressing that one in and try and get it in as hard as you can. And the best you can get it in. But anyway, thanks for watching this video of the unboxing of the PSU for the PC build. Please check out any of the videos on the screen if you haven't seen them yet. Hope to see you guys tomorrow at 6pm GMT. And please like, subscribe, comment below. Also comment below if you think I cheaped out on this power supply.